Welcome to general readings for, oh my gosh, we're in June already. Your money readings are going to look like this and your love readings are gonna look like this. And so you can be looking forward to those to come out throughout the month. So let's get started. Scorpio. So you are not the best thing to ever happen to you this month. You might be in your own way, okay? So um, you need to be a little bit harder on yourself. You need to push yourself a little bit further. They're saying this is a month where karmic completion can happen and the new beginnings start that are really wonderful for you, um, that build a strong foundation for all of your dreams. But it is important then that we allow things to end so that a new beginning can start. So beginning of the month, they're saying... Things are out of the ordinary and you might be feeling a little bit on your own. You might be feeling a little bit separate from other people. However, take that time to get super organized and to create a plan for yourself. In the middle of the month, your intuition is on point. You should very much trust your gut instincts when we get to the end of the month. It might not be the end of the month that you envisioned. It might not be what you want. However, the best part of the month is that you already know what's coming, that um, the secrets are shared with you, that somebody gives you information. Maybe it's your tarot reader, maybe it's a friend, um, but you know what to expect. The biggest challenge is just to create a good, solid, long-term plan for your life, for yourself, you know, for your money, for your career, um, things like that. So the um, guidance here is think about what you want for your long-term future. What is it you're manifesting? What is it, like if your life could be better in any area of it, how, what would it take? Like what would you add to it? Not what would you subtract, but what would you add to your life to make it better? They're saying you don't have to tell anyone, you don't have to write it down, but we do have to figure out what we have to move away from in order to welcome those energies. If you need assistance with any of these energies, your crystals of the month um, look like this. You can find those in my blog page on the link below and I love you so much.